In this session, we'll look at how Dynamics has helped customers in insurance move from paper-based files into electronic document management. Many of our customers have similar problems. They're held back by their paperwork. Invoices, policy documents, endorsements, claims and reports and many others all require filing. Finding physical files is time-consuming. Paper file storage takes up a lot of space. Documents are often not effectively controlled and lack security, auditing, archiving or destruction at the appropriate time. I'm going to show you how Microsoft SharePoint changes that. SharePoint is great at storing electronic documents and paper scans. It scales up to be fast with many millions of documents in the system. It works well with Microsoft's other popular products, such as Outlook, Word and Excel. I'll be showing you the latest SharePoint 2013 version, which is a little faster and easier to use. Otherwise, everything here applies equally to SharePoint 2010. Knowledge Lake products add a simple way to get documents into SharePoint. Knowledge Lake Connect allows documents to be flowed or dragged from Outlook and Office products into SharePoint. Knowledge Lake Capture does the same for scanned paper documents, which we'll focus on in another video. Knowledge Lake Imaging makes classification fast by linking classification lookups against data in the customer's existing systems without changing them. Fast and accurate document classification is key to a successful document management system. Importantly, SharePoint and Knowledge Lake work together to ensure we classify documents with the right information so that we can find them and don't lose them. Underwriters are most often working with firm orders referenced in the policy administration system. We take advantage of this information to auto-index documents using fast lookups with minimal keying. This allows us to configure real-time lookups, giving visual feedback such as the insured name and automatic retrieval of other values used later when searching for the documents. Sales and broking teams, on the other hand, are working on new business or prospective clients and don't enter them on the policy or quote system until they're close to winning business. They need a method to create a filing structure in a more ad hoc fashion, and they need a quick way to classify against it, like drag and drop. For these situations, we define specific types of classification folders, which can have lookups validated by the business systems, but are not limited to this. These folders can then be pre-created when required by the users and properly classified. These special folders will then automatically classify any document dropped into them. This is popular because it combines high-quality document indexing with the ease of drag and drop from Outlook. We work with our customers to understand their teams and divisions to keep these classification approaches simple and really easy to use. This system in this demo has been configured to give you a feel for some of the classifications we've implemented on document management solutions for our clients in the insurance industry. Finally, I'll also be showing you some search screens in SharePoint using Knowledge Lake Imaging that allow these documents to be quickly found and worked with instantly. My story starts with an email. We can see here that I have an email arrive that I need to file into the SharePoint document management system. Notice here that there's a Knowledge Lake tab at the top of Microsoft Outlook. I can click to open the sites available to me and the document classifications that have been configured. I'm going to drag and drop this as general correspondence. And we can see here some classification information is mandatory and some optional. This is all based around how users of the system may need to find documents later. In our experience, understanding how the customer teams work is key to getting this balance right for a document management system that works well for the business and doesn't create work when classifying. The system must allow fast, efficient classification, otherwise the solution will not be accepted as a success. This is the indexing panel, 
where I'm helped to classify the type of document and provide its key information. Notice here that I have some optional information that I can classify the document with, and now there's some mandatory information. Note that the policy numbers are available in real time from the underwriting system. When I choose a policy number, we can see here that it's automatically retrieved the insured client name, so I can validate that I have the correct policy number. There's also some more information that needs to be stored for this type of document. Clicking Save, you should see the document go up directly into the SharePoint Document Management System, and my queue is now empty. So, Knowledge Lake Imaging allows us to link SharePoint into the company's existing business system in real time without changing it. I should add that installation and configuration doesn't require any custom software beyond the Knowledge Lake and SharePoint off-the-shelf products. Let's compare this to how classification folders with drag-and-drop indexing can work, such as for brokers. I'll select our SharePoint Broker demo system. This one's been configured using classification folders. Notice that there are simple sets of folders in here that have been pre-created. When we drop a document into these end folders, it will be automatically classified. I'll now drag and drop this document into this particular classification folder. All I need to do is define the type of document this is, which of course can be limited to specific types of documents in specific areas, and I don't have to provide any further information. We have some optional information here we can add, but otherwise we just click Save, which will allow the document to be uploaded directly into SharePoint. The document's now fully indexed against that customer, the year and class of business, with just a few clicks and no typing. With either approach to classification, the result is that you can find all relevant documents and scans fast. Let's move on to the final piece on how we can effectively search for documents using search pages in SharePoint. Searches are typically kept really simple. They're similar to how the document files were found in the past. Searches are usually shared between teams, and because SharePoint manages security trimming of the search results, Nobody ever finds a document they shouldn't. These pages may look a little crammed to keep the size of this video small. In reality, customers typically use 20-inch or larger flat screens to give pin-sharp results. One nice improvement in SharePoint 2013 is the focus on content that will give me a little more room to work in this demo. Searches are designed around your business-as-usual needs such as finding documents relating to a policy number or insured name. There's usually a general search and a few optimised for differing teams, such as claims. Notice how instantly the search results appeared. Search and View screen allows immediate access to the documents on screen without opening lots of windows. On a good sized screen, these are quite readable. Users can combine these predefined searches with the ability to find documents using a word or phrase within them, even for scanned documents. I'm now going to add some text that only appears in a document. When working with lots of results, users can drag columns to group the documents or change their sort order on the fly. To work on a document full screen, we simply click its icon. With the full screen viewer, users can annotate scanned documents with notes and stamps, just as they did in the paper files. We also have some great features to send links to this document, or even to bookmark sections in the document, to work more effectively with colleagues than we could on paper. Users can work on Word and Excel documents in the document system together, without keeping separate copies. All actions and access is audited, and document retention and destruction can be configured, ensuring the system meets the customer's compliance needs. This is all out-of-the-box functionality with SharePoint and Knowledge Lake Imaging. 
SharePoint can be customised and extended by developers, but we find this is rarely needed because there is so much to SharePoint out of the box. In our experience, the missing piece is to ensure documents are well classified, which Knowledge Lake provides effectively. The result is elegant document organisation and a smooth flow of work, without losing time finding those paper files, managing complicated network shared drives or any ongoing costs of non-compliance. Of our many satisfied customers, I'd like to share this quotation from a global insurance broker. Probably our most successful project, on time and on budget. In this particular project, we worked with their internal transition team to build a simple baseline classification system for four of their 26 divisions and empowered the customer's technical team to continue supporting the system and to continue refining and rolling this out to all the remaining divisions of the business. Dynamics is a Microsoft Gold partner and has assembled a product portfolio specifically within the Microsoft and .NET space for document management, process automation, scanning and imaging, and we're able to assist with rapid project delivery. For a great solution to your paper problem, FAST, where we work with you and what you have, from discovery, design, installation, training, and through your Go Live transition, please contact us by visiting our website or contacting us by email or Twitter. For further videos, please visit our YouTube channel.